Yeah, the Prince is back. This time I'm more in nature. I like to switch up my environment. Keep y'all guessing where the fuck I'll be next. All right. Yeah. Let's <clears throat> just see real quick. Yeah. See this just. So, let's get straight into the topic of this video, right? This is gonna be another how-to video. So this is one of the important things. Every video is important that I make. And this is one of the important ones, right? So this video will be about how to use body language to seduce females. I'll just I'll give you basically a sequence of what I do and how I basically uh, the way I seduce females just using my body. As I say in a lot of videos, you know, the concepts are always the same. And I'm expanding on the concepts, especially when guys ask me questions. But I say in many videos that what you say does not really matter. If anything, I tell you to talk as little as possible to these females. Because what that does is it makes you seem mysterious, right? Now, how do you use your body in order to convey uh, sexual tension? Because that's the only way you can create sexual tension, using your body and your body language. And I'm going to tell you a little bit of how to read these girls, right? So the number one concept that you have to understand is this emotional transference. So what the fuck is this term? I'm using all these fancy terms, emotional transference. So emotional transference is your ability to transfer what you feel inside to other people, right? That is an extremely important skill you have to have if you want to be uh, just go with people. If you want to be charming, if you want to make people do stuff for you, if you want to make pe people feel a certain type of way, the best way to do that is to concentrate that feeling inside of you. And when you make that feeling strong enough, the other person is going to start feeling the exact same way. Now, in regards to women, that is extremely important because the way you feel inside is the way you feel. It's, it's just the way she's going to feel. Now, if you're on a date and you're all nervous, right? You're talkative, you're kind of goofy. There's going to be zero sexual tension that she's going to have because you don't have it. Does it make sense? Like a female is not going to create sexual tension uh, on her own just because she wants to. She is responding to what you feel. Females are receptive by nature, okay? So every time I go on a date, right? And it's funny because sometimes I, I like consciously, now it's very unconscious, right? But sometimes I just consciously observe the way I deal with females. So I'll be with a friend and I'll be, you know, a little bit more goofy, kind of like more entertaining, a little bit like in the YouTube videos. But then a female comes up all of a sudden. And all of a sudden, ooh, gotta, gotta be masculine. Gotta have sexual tension. Gotta, you know, be smooth. Gotta make a be horny deep inside. And the way I do it is deep down in me, I slow down, you know. I create this tension within myself, you know. The way I look at her, I squint a little bit, you know, talking a deeper voice, laid back, relaxed. That's the feeling you want to create. Why? Because that's the feeling that's gonna make females comfortable. You have to make females comfortable, okay? There's certain ways you have to make females feel, okay? Number one, you have to like convey power and respect, right? The only way to do that is uh, obviously by ha having other men respect you, but, but uh, the way you carry yourself, your confidence. A female is not gonna respect you if not confident. So if you like lay back, you, you, you concentrate deep inside of you, being laid back, you know, you deep in your voice, you create the sexual tension inside your own body. What that then does is that makes her, that, that makes you seem way more confident, okay? And then it makes her comfortable as well. Because instead of being all this anxious, hey, uh, goofing around, sh sh like th that, that makes females feel some type of way. But you have to like calm down, lower your, just your whole vibe. This is all about vibe. Make your vibe a certain way that screams, uh, we could fuck some. That's what this vibe screams, right? And once you create that vibe inside of you, she will now feel the same way. Now, there's two types of female that I talk about on this channel, right? As I said, I'm basically repeating myself, right? But there is the females that 
want you and the females that don't want you. Basically, there's receptive females and non-receptive females, right? The non-receptive females, they won't really respond to this, right? So even though you're having this sexual charm inside of you, you try to emotionally transfer that state to her, she's just not gonna accept it, basically. And that's how you know a female is not interested in you. And we're gonna go over that a little bit more and how to like flesh it out and the tests I give women in order to see how Are coming by disturbing my video but <clears throat> there are certain tests I, I sequences I go with I go through with women in order to determine if they really like me or if it's just fake because you have to realize this a lot of females fake it right so even though you're having this emotional transference some feet like females are crazy they will literally go so far okay they will make it seem like they like you they'll even accept this emotional transference right but at the end of the day if you're trying to fuck she's gonna have some type of excuse it's also like females are just like that so you have to have certain tests that you give these females right so so guys i paused the video i don't know who the fuck is making all these noises around me okay okay i understand the birds are chirping but i see a fucking cars riding around fucking music playing what, what the can't, can't just be left alone for a second uh, so where was i emotional transference right some females literally they they will accept your emotional transference right because they, they just want to feel sexy they just want to feel wanted right they just want to flirt a little bit but then when it really comes down to it oh oh oops sorry can't F females are literally like that but the good thing is with usually if you're doing this emotional transfer right and uh, you, you can sense that a female is starting to feel the same way right and her body language is, is reflecting that right like she's facing you she's not very really facing away she's looking at you but we're gonna cover that okay and that is usually a telltale sign that the female is very very interested right like like the, the test i give women is like the filter women out right so for example the faster i get the number the, the more likely a girl is interested in me right but there's still a chance that she might be just playing right i've had girls they'll literally say they're interested right they give me the number they say they want to meet me or they'll even like they, they will uh ask me or they will propose a day that they can meet me right but then when it comes to it oh nowhere to be find found nowhere to be found right girls girls like that right but for example if i do the date fast pop it on the screen if i ask for the date fast right then maybe like i'll fuck 80 percent of these girls 20 percent of them will be so bullshit right but then if i want to date with them and i make them feel a certain way with this emotional transference then most likely like 95 percent of the time i'll fuck them right so it, like what this does it reduces the chances of of me fucking up like dating girls is kind of like it's kind of like chess you know in chess it's literally all about avoiding mistakes always making the best move right and what i'm doing here is i'm avoiding mistakes i'm avoiding meeting with females who are not trying to fuck right so God, music playing again. whatever let's continue this fucking video <clears throat> now one test that i like to give females when i'm on a date with them right and i'm talking with them and all that and it's going good and we're sitting down right i'll just grab her hand literally like either i'll take her hand and hold it like this right or what i do is i just take my hand and put it on her thigh right what that does it's a little test right i want to see how the female reacts now if the female is i can see she, like she's kind of getting uncomfortable or she's kind of pulling away then that's a sign that she's not really that interested okay because that's a touch test that's what i mean with body language okay you need to ob observe a female's body language and see if she's really that interested okay <clears throat> now another sign that i look for with girls is eye contact right is she looking at you in the eyes and also smiling at the same time okay that is usually a sign that the girl likes you and is very comfortable with you and that is perfect because you be looking her in the eyes you have a you know good body language you be talking the more deep and seductive voice emotional transference you know you be looking at her a little bit sideways you know having all this sexual tension building up in yourself and then giving it to her you know what i'm saying that's how this works and then if she's comfortable with that and she locks eyes eye contact with you and she's not really looking away and even better let's say she looks away but she looks like down right so she'll be looking down and then up to you again that is a telltale sign that the female is being very very receptive right and that she's very very interested in you right so you do all these things and those are all signs that the female is into you and you use emotional transference to transfer that to her 
okay so i want you guys to notice emotional transference right write this down that is basically what it's all about when dating these females you have to be able to switch vibes very quickly right the same way you talk to your friends is not the same way you're supposed to talk talk with your girl like it doesn't matter wife it doesn't matter if girlfriend it doesn't matter if uh uh just a random girl dating a quick fuck it does not matter you have to carry yourself in a certain way D does that make sense okay you cannot have a friendly vibe with these females if you create a friendly vibe like you just like treat her as a friend or you just need to talk normally the way you talk with your friends the way she's gonna view you is oh he's probably just a friend because you're giving her that emotional state you have to give you have to give it an emotional state of like we are about to fuck right like when I'm with these girls, all my movements they totally slow down, right? I look, I lock eye contact, right? Even the way I smile is different, right? Like with, with friends, the, I'll be smiling like this. <laughs> that's funny, haha, huh? right? But with girls, we're like, oh, <laughs> yeah, that's kind of funny, you know? Because everything is different, and that's because the way I make myself feel inside, right? <clears throat> That is gonna be the best way to use body language to seduce girls. You don't need all these fancy tricks. Like, you know, I've seen videos where they talk about fancy tricks with like, uh, I don't even know, like, like certain things if you do, and then like triangle gaze. Uh, that's that's one. I fucking I used to watch this video, and he was telling uh, like one way to start kissing a girl is you do a triangle fucking gaze. So you look one eye and next eye, and then the mouth, and you keep repeating that, and all of a sudden the girl wants to kiss you. Like, oh, it's just a bunch of bullshit. Okay. It's just a bunch of bullshit. All you need to do is you need to get the girls, right, that are semi-interested in you, right? Because you asked them if they want to hang out, they said yes, right? So they're at least semi-interested, right? So now you do this emotional transference, right? You, you, you make them feel a certain way. That's what pimps do. They make the girls feel a certain way, right? So that sh she's even more receptive, right? And then if you touch, like if you put your hand on her thigh like this, Right? And it stays there, and she's comfortable with it, right? Or you're holding her hand, right? You just grab the hand, I, like don't don't be a pussy. Just take, just be, oh, when you're on a date, just take your hand like this, and then take her hand, T take it like this. She might be like, what? And then you, you just keep talking, done. Just just be a boss about it, right? And and then on and on top of that, uh, you lock eye contact with her, look look her a little bit sideways, you know, be like a little bit like extra smooth and sexy, right? And if she's comfortable with all that and she's smiling, that girl is ready to be fucked. I'm telling you, okay? There, there is no way on this planet a girl will do all of this, spend time with you, be with you, that she do all these things and she doesn't want to fuck, okay? It's just about progressively going through these steps, okay? And not doing mistakes. Do not do the mistakes of creating a friendly vibe. Do not do the mistake of creating a goofy vibe. Do not do the mistake of not creating a sexual vibe. If you do all these mistakes, none of the taxes that I'm saying are gonna work, okay? Not even you being an, an, a hyper alpha male, not even you being a high value guy is gonna work, okay? Because she's gonna see you as a friend. Plan, just simple, simple. You, you could be Leonardo DiCaprio, right? If there's no, if there's, fucking, if there's no sexual tension in the air, okay? You could be a, a fucking model, okay? It, it could be a famous model if there, if you're not creating sexual tension in the air, right? Nothing's gonna happen. So you create a sexual tension by creating it first in yourself. If you're creating yourself, females are geniuses at feeling what you can feel, right? It's a human tendency, but females are about 10 times better than men at doing that. So you just create it in yourself, the vibe, right? And do the certain things that I said. And you, your chances of fucking these females are gonna skyrocket, I'm telling you. And then pairing that with not saying much so that what she's saying does not interfere with your body language, I am telling you, your interaction with females will fundamentally change. I'm telling you. You can thank me later once, this, once you do this and you see this works. So like, share, and subscribe. See you next video. Done.